To fight for independence from Japan's colonial rule, the Korean provisional government was established. To remember their efforts, a national memorial museum has opened in Seoul. Baeunji tells us more. On March 1, 1919, hundreds of thousands of Koreans took to the streets in peaceful demonstrations to protest against the Japanese colonization that began in 1910. A declaration of independence was read at a rally in Seoul, and mass demonstrations took place across the country. On April 11th, shortly after this March 1st movement, South Korean patriots formed a provisional government in Shanghai. To remember this history and the sacrifices of its leading figures, the National Memorial of the Korean Provisional Government has opened in central Seoul. This memorial opened to the public from March shows how the Korean Provisional Government was first established in 1919 and how it fought for independence from Japan's colonial rule. Comprised of three permanent exhibitions and one special exhibition, the museum preserves and displays some 1,000 pieces, including around 300 historical documents and artifacts, and 700 historical pictures. This is going to be a place where visitors can understand the foundation of South Korea. Also, as most of the relics related to the provisional government are in China, the memorial will help overcome these limits and enable Korean citizens to see and experience the history during their daily lives. The historical documents on display include a report on the establishment of the Korean Liberation Army's headquarters, which declared that the army of the provisional government was officially formed. After liberation, this became the foundation of the Korean Armed Forces. The memorial also displays a note to Koreans at home and abroad on plans for how the country will be run after liberation and sheet music for the Korean national anthem, with lyrics in Korean, Chinese and English. The Ministry of Patriots and Veterans Affairs said it plans to display more historical documents and relics at the memorial after doing additional research. Arirang News.